Amongst the natural landscape of hills and lakes, the National Chemical Laboratory or NCL was established in 1950 in Pune. Spread over a sprawling campus of nearly 500 acres, it was declared open on January 3, 1950 by the then Honourable Prime Minister of India, Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. A constituent laboratory of the Council of Scientific and Industrial Research or CSIR, which is one of the world's largest publicly funded R&D organizations. NCL has a staff strength of over 1,600, including about 300 research scientists, many of them with postdoctoral qualifications from abroad. In addition, NCL also has a large number of students pursuing their PhD programs. NCL is today rated internationally as a world-class R&D institution, known for its excellence in the areas of catalysis, polymer science, organic chemistry, chemical engineering sciences, inorganic materials, nanotechnology and biochemical sciences. The catalysis research at NCL covers both heterogeneous and homogeneous catalysis aimed at developing innovative catalysts in the areas of petrochemicals, organic intermediates and fine chemicals. With world-class expertise in catalytic materials like zeolites, metallosilicates, metal oxides and other mesoporous materials ranging from catalyst design, synthesis and characterization, the Catalysis Group has competencies in reactions involving halogenation, acylation, oxidation, alkylation and nitration. The Catalyst Pilot Plant, which can scale up and optimize the Catalyst know-how developed at NCL, can manufacture the catalysts where 50 to 100 kg solid catalyst can be produced per batch and supplied to companies for catalyst testing purposes. The homogeneous catalysis group with expertise in soluble metal complexes, supported metal catalysts, biphasic catalysis and multiphase catalytic systems has extensive experience in handling gases like oxygen, hydrogen and carbon monoxide under high pressure and temperature conditions. The laboratories are well equipped with a variety of micro to macro scale stirred pressure reactors, fixed bed catalytic reactors trickle bed and continuous stirred tank reactors carrying out research on industrially important reactions involving carbonylation, oxidative carbonylation, hydroformylation, amination, hydrogenation and liquid phase oxidation. The group has extensive competencies in kinetic modeling, analysis of multiphase catalytic systems and development of reactor performance models. The polymer science and engineering research at NCL encompasses expertise in the areas of polymer chemistry, novel drug delivery systems, complex fluids and polymer engineering, polymer processing, polymer modeling, conducting polymers, nanofillers, photopolymers and membrane sciences. The complex fluids and rheology group investigates structure and dynamics in materials and translates this understanding to develop structure-property relationships for polymers, foods, gels, surfactants and colloidal solutions. The laboratory has state-of-the-art rheology equipment coupled with in-situ optical tools for structural characterization that allow measurements in shear and elongational flow. The Polymer Processing Center is a unique facility among the academic and research institutions in India. The center is equipped with pilot-scale polymer processing and mechanical characterization facilities such as the DSM microcompounder, microinjection molding machine, burst-off twin screw extruder, hack polylab, Instron UTM and assessed Izod impact tester. The Membrane Science and Technology Group has developed and patented a flat sheet ultrafiltration membrane which has pores small enough to exclude pathogenic species like virus and bacteria yet porous enough to be able to operate at tap water pressure. The concept which has wide applications in the domestic and rural sector is in commercial production today. The group also has state-of-the-art characterization facilities such as gel permeation chromatographs, photon correlation spectrophotometers, polarizing optical microscopes, ultramicrotone, HPLC, FTIR, thermal analyzers and dynamic mechanical analyzer. 
The Organic Chemistry and Technology Group is engaged in new drug development programs, process chemistry, custom synthesis, synthesis of new chemical entities with clinical potential, isolation of natural products and evaluation of bioactivity besides organic chemicals research and development. The group has competencies in the areas of asymmetric synthesis, biocatalytic transformations, execution of multi-step organic synthesis, carbohydrate chemistry, color chemistry and scale-up capabilities up to kilogram level. The bioorganic and biomimetic chemistry group is involved with interfacing synthetic organic chemistry with biological and materials chemistry to develop novel therapeutic, diagnostic and functional materials. Expertise also exists in structural chemistry to explore phenomena such as polymorphism, crystallization and crystal habits. The Combinatorial Chemistry Bioresource Center aims for development of compound libraries for lead discovery, processing of medicinal plants based on activity, bioassays for high throughput screening, new targets for HDS assay developments, new molecular scaffolds as inhibitors of specific disease targets designed using chemoinformatics. The center is equipped with a high throughput screening system, SEP box, parallel synthesizer, HD evaporation system, accelerated solvent extractor and a simulated moving bed chromatography system. The center is expected to accelerate discoveries of new lead compounds and utilization of the vast natural biodiversity of India for value-added products. The Chemical Engineering Division seeks to exploit the fundamentals of chemical engineering sciences to improve operability, efficiency and quality of products in the chemical industry. The group has multi-purpose pilot plants for scale-up and optimization of the processes developed at NCL. Other competencies within the group include expertise in modeling and simulation, artificial intelligence and preparation of the basic engineering packages. The industrial flow modeling group develops and harnesses computational fluid dynamics or CFD and other modeling tools to optimize and develop complex industrial processes and products. The Theory and Computational Sciences Group, which interfaces with almost all major disciplines of science, provides a fundamental conceptual understanding of different phenomena at atomic and molecular level through development of new algorithms using the principle of quantum chemistry. The Materials Chemistry Division has a unique blend of solid-state chemists and condensed matter physicists who are engaged in R&D on a variety of functional hybrid materials with applications in molecular electronics, hydrogen energy storage, sensors and actuators. Nanomaterials are expected to play a key role in many emerging technologies. One of the key areas of competence at NCL is in the biosynthesis of nanoparticles employing enzymatic approaches. The Agricultural Biotechnology Group brings the techniques of plant tissue culture and molecular biology aspects like gene prospecting, DNA molecular markers and transgenics for the improvement of plantation, horticulture, forestry and oilseed crops. The group has state-of-the-art plant tissue culture and molecular biology facilities including bioreactors for scaling up of cell, tissue and organ cultures. The macromolecular X-ray diffraction facility is used for elucidating three-dimensional structures of large biomolecules such as proteins and protein complexes with applications in understanding molecular recognition and interactions in identifying defective molecules and drug targets and in protein engineering. The National Collection of Industrial Microorganisms or NCIM which is responsible for the isolation, collection, preservation and distribution of cultures holds about 3,700 microbial strains and supports NCL's research efforts in the areas of enzyme-based eco-friendly technologies, secondary metabolites, biotransformation reactions and bioinsecticides. The Center for Materials Characterization which provides the necessary analytical facilities for research and development, has facilities for electron spectroscopy, scanning electron microscopy, transmission electron microscopy, X-ray diffractometry and mass spectroscopy measurements. The central NMR facility has world-class expertise for solid and solution state NMR and can provide spectroscopic techniques to support diverse research areas. 
Major research at present is focused here in the area of newer materials. NCL has been in the forefront of deploying information technologies to help scientists keep abreast in their areas of research. The Digital Information Resource Center or the DIRC contributes to the laboratory's objectives by bringing together information, knowledge, tools and systems for informed decision making and provides online access to a number of journals and leading databases across the world from leading publishers like Elsevier Science, American Chemical Society, Royal Society of Chemistry and Wiley Interscience. The NCL library, which is one of the best of its kind in India, with more than 130,000 books, is used by a number of companies in the area of chemical and allied sciences in India. Today, NCL earns about $2.5 million per year from industry through contract research, consultancy, licensing, royalty and other technical services. On an average, NCL publishes about 400 research papers in peer-reviewed journals and is granted about 25 US patents every year. NCL works with about 75 industrial clients per year, out of which about 25% are from abroad. NCL's customer base spans all across the world and global companies contribute to about 50% of NCL's industrial income. In the process, NCL honors and maintains its confidentiality obligations with the clients and even refrains from working with competitors in similar areas. The Business Development Division serves as a vital link between the activities of NCL scientific groups and marketplace, identifying potential customers for NCL's knowledge base, facilitating techno-commercial negotiations and managing all aspects related to contracts, pricing and intellectual property rights. The group works in close cooperation with scientists, industries, government, financial institutions and other statutory agencies and develops newer models for expeditiously bringing the benefits of modern science and technology to the marketplace. The NCL Innovation Park, which houses a 10,000 square feet business incubator, aims to promote startups and spin-off companies. The park leverages on NCL scientific expertise to nurture ideas and transform them into commercially viable processes and products. Over the last 50 years, NCL has repeatedly risen to meet the challenges of changing times. We are once again witnessing major changes in the Indian R&D landscape. NCL is truly on the move. Several new initiatives that are now in execution or in planning will substantially change the character of NCL and transform the organization into a powerful knowledge partner in the years to come.